Well, just want to show you how to make DIY uh, fuse bar. Connect a fuse bar to a fuse bar, uh, fuse to get your um, protection on your battery bank. Today, I already made this uh, shot the video. Um, finish up the work before shooting the video. It's a two odd cable, 250 amp fuse fuse and uh, this uh, fuse block can handle up to about 300 amps to 400 so I'm using this device for a 24 volt battery bank you can able use it to 48 volt battery bank respectively 12 volts you can do it depends uh, what your um, your drawer is gonna be and uh, how much load you put into this because this fuse block is not going to handle that and the fuse itself is too small for 12 volt which uh, 12 volt probably needs about uh, 400 you know 400 amps or 450 amp hour 450 amps fuse it depends what you're trying to do so I'm gonna incorporate this device with it which is a battery disconnect that's going to go on the other side of this guy right here to give me a complete shutdown onto the battery bank. So it's going to connect like this. This other side is going to go into the bus bar where you're going to feed the power, which if you don't have a bus bar, you just connect your batteries directly from the battery terminal positive all the way. This one attached to the battery positive come into the fuse, the fuse to the disconnect disconnect to your load so this is just a uh, um, uh, simple uh, DIY setup here for um, uh, low cost or whatever you want to call it these are ANL fuse you can buy anywhere from Amazon or you can buy the blue seal you can buy your um, whatever uh, eBay or whatever things online then you can able to incorporate all this stuff together and build up your very strong and robust um, connections for your thing so I'm gonna show you this cover is gonna go on top of this to cover protect the uh, the circuit so that I can have anything dropped into this and uh, two hot cable two hot um, battery logs and uh, this one can handle up to about three to four hundred amps. You can see right there is handle up to one thousand, one thousand two hundred and fifty amps DC, which is uh, continuous at two hundred and seventy-five amp hours. All right. So these are mostly designed for uh, marine, which is for boats and all the. Uh, good stuff you want to do and this one can handle uh, 50 volts respectively you know you can able to go up to uh, 48 volt system so this is how you can do stuff see that 50 volts DC max can take and it takes about 1250 amp hours and continues at 275 amp hours so this is a very strong and robust machine I'm building here for DIY project. If you like it, please subscribe, like, and share from JW Solar USA. Take care. All right, JW Solar USA is back, and the cover is already here to protect this stuff. And I'm going to show you how this one is going to attach to this side right here. And I'm going to have two, one more wire coming from this side, which will be one of these guys. The logs is already marked so this one is going to be coming from this other side from here and this one is going to have another log going to a bus bar the positive bus bar that where all the loads going to be connected to this one comes from the bus bar from the batteries where um, the batteries terminal is going to tie it into the fuse and cut off so protection the power comes here surge this one's gonna break this is not gonna work and no power out here 
shut the power right here the power is still gonna flow right here protect anything that when you turn this one full rush of power is gonna protect um, the loads coming on running uh, full speed so that's why you have to have a fuse just after the battery or the battery terminal so battery bank to the disconnect and to the load you can have the disconnect right here and have the the, the fuse and to the load is not a good way to do it you have to have the fuse first so everything that comes first it goes to go past to the security uh, clearance right from here so this is your security clearance it comes here pass here first and comes to the brake and to the loads you cannot break and fuse you can break first this if the brake what you can break first and fuse later you have to break first before you disconnect okay you gotta break first you gotta fuse first and break okay this is how it works i hope you get this one clear and uh just a quick uh, diy project for you i hope you you like please subscribe like and share and thanks for watching I really appreciate you guys watching my videos and thanks for commenting. Come back and check on the channel for more uh, future content coming on your way. As we fast approach in spring here, you're going to be seeing all kind of projects coming up with more new installed solar panels and DIY project and off-grid and grid tie solar systems. We are ready here, already fired up, ready for the season and uh, you will see what i have for you here it's a lot of surprising on the table but you gotta keep um turn the uh the the sub subscription bell to have a notification and we can go from there all right youtube this is the end product right now i already got all the break disconnect the fuse the disconnect and uh the right side is going to the battery the left side is going to um to the loads and you guys can see this is switch so the green side indicate there is on and is off so this is how I'm wrapping up the uh, the installation the DIY project for the off-grid solar power house and our power home and this is how you DIY fuse disconnect project for your battery bank uh, a low cost instead of you buying all the expensive st stuff you can put all this stuff it does cost some money if you put all these things together how much it costs the two hot cable the logs the disconnect the uh, the 250 amp uh, fuse and uh, 400 amp uh, fuse block and plus labor and um in the time this is all you do it well i'm just teaching you how to do the simple stuff like this for your diy project and stuff for, instead of spending a lot of money and you can make it the way you want it you know in kind of cheap way where it's kind of expensive way and keep your system safe and the way you want it and read it for your battery bank and for all the loads you're going to be pulling from your system from the Minnesota JW Solar USA. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and share. Um, click on the bell so that you can have notification for my next feature videos posted. And uh, share the videos with your friends. Bye for now.